So token age consumed, or burn rate, as it used to be called, shows the amount of tokens changing addresses on a certain date multiplied by the number of blocks that were created on the blockchain since the last time those tokens moved. That means that the spikes on this graph will signal a large amount of tokens moving after being idle or after not moving for an extended period of time. So you may ask, why is this an important event to track in the first place? Or what does this really tell us? And one of the potential use cases for this metric can be identifying when large market players begin to exit the project after an ICO. So we're looking at an example here. This is a token edge consume graph for Golem. Golem is an ERC-20 project that basically lets you rent other people's computing power. And we can easily see a couple of different spikes in token age consumed on the Golem's graph. And each of these could be a large early investor in Golem leaving the project, i.e. selling their tokens. And that also almost every time, as you can see here, results in a price decline afterwards. So for example, look at this guy right here. This is likely a large investor that was able to successfully predict or recognize a top and decided to cash out. And we can see what that did to the market afterwards or how the market reacted. So there's another graph that attempts to explain similar events. That is average token age consumed in days. Now, both of these measure the same thing. That is the idleness of tokens. But this graph does it a bit differently. So where the token age consumed graph measures the idleness in the blocks that were created on the blockchain since the last time that the tokens moved, this graph measures it in a number of days that passed since the last time that those tokens moved. But in tandem, really, these two token consumption metrics try to show you when sleepy tokens, so to say, finally start moving. And really, no matter what the reason for that is, there is usually a matching reaction to those movements that you want to be on the lookout for.